children i hope you are doing well today we are going to read and understand few more passages from the story seher goes stargazing after this activity you will be able to read and understand the lesson before that be ready with your worksheet number 43 a pencil and an eraser topic seher goes stargazing activity number 1 2 and 3 so children let's read and understand the passages from the story children repeat each sentence after me so who first discovered and wrote about comets asked seher an english astronomer by the name of edmund halley discovered and first wrote about comets and their moments some small comets melt completely and are never seen again some big comets reappear many times because only a small part of the ice melts when it comes near the sun one particular comet that halley so was named after him because he calculated correctly that it would reappear every 75 years and it does the last time halley's comet came near the sun and the earth was in 1986 Before that it was seen in 1910 long before even your grandparents were born both times people all over the world stood outside at night to see it The next time it comes near the earth will be in the year 2061. How old will you be then? Seher laughed at the thought and said, "That will allow me so much more time to learn about stars i think i want to be an astronomer and discover new things excellent seher in fact in late 2011 scientists discovered another solar system with two suns and as many planets as our system they have also discovered that mars has a hundred times more water than was thought earlier the universe is infinite 
There is a lot more waiting to be discovered. Maybe you will make the next big discovery. Let's move to activity number one. Read the paragraphs 5 to 7 from the textbook. Page number 62 to 63 and answer the questions given below. Pick the correct answer. Comet was discovered by Edmund Halley. Rahul or Rita. The correct answer is Edmund Halley. In the same way, you have to continue with the remaining questions. Let's move to activity number 2. Read the extracts given below and answer the following questions. Excellent Seher. Who said these words? Father said these words. To whom was it said? It was said to Seher. Let's move to activity number 3. Write the conversation between Seher and her father. Let us see an example. That will allow me so much more time to learn about stars. So children, in the same way, you have to write the conversation between Seher and her father in the given speech bubbles. And your home play is to complete the worksheet number 43 and share it with your subject teacher. Thank you.